Hi guys and welcome back to my channel um, and if you're new here then welcome my name is Lucy I'm a mummy of one of little Miss Amelia over here um, that will keep bothering me so just bear with me um, and I do all sorts of mummy videos careful baby and grocery hauls um, cleaning videos and whatever you guys request so if you do have any requests for me I'm a working mum then please comment down below baby mummy's gonna have to use us this video is a things that I use to teach my toddler um, I know that I find those kind of videos helpful just in like toys careful just like toys and things um, that you can use to teach your toddler and um, she's two year old so these are things that we are currently using um, and that she can do and things that we obviously do with her because some of it is a bit for older kids um, but she's always been a child that's been interested in things so she always wants to move on to the next thing so I'm just gonna show you guys a few things that we do to teach her um, and the first thing that we got when she was about like nine months old or something she still loves this um, is actually the Mr. Men book, she loves the, like these kind of books, but it's a Mr. Men book, we bought this when she was like nine months old and did it with her like every day, um, and she could count <laughs> to ten from about, I think, I mean obviously she didn't know what she was doing, but she could do it since she was about 15 or 16 um, months, and she still loves that book. Mommy needs to show, and all it is basically, it's literally just like counting everything so it's like one hat I think it says two shoes and it goes all the way to ten um, and she loved that and I really believe that this book just really helped her because she can see it and she even still likes to just um, sit and do it now and she'll just start counting whenever she sees that book um, another thing that we have and that I do with her obviously this one is a bit for older kids and I just got this off Amazon. Um, I will link, try and link everything that I did get off of Amazon down in the description box because most of these things I ordered online. Um, and it's just like a little learning box. And it's got numbers in there. And it's got like a little counter. It's got a little clock inside. I won't open it now because the pieces will go everywhere. But um, it's got all the pieces in there. But how I use it at the minute is because it has the numbers in, I will ask her to give me the number five or give me the number one. Um, and we just make like a little activity out of it, finding all the things. And obviously when she gets older, we can then use it for to help her with her maths homework and things like that. So that's another thing that we use. Um, I'm not going to show you everything that we use. Um, and that she plays with that's educational because otherwise we we'll, might be here all day. Another thing that baby, 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 can mommy just do this? I guess sorry about that. I am back. If I do keep looking down, it's to get um, things up to show you guys. So another thing that we have that is a little. Where does it go? Um, that she really, really like now it's like I don't know what you call it but I think it's like a puzzle so I'll show you just take it apart it's like a container like that and it's got like different pictures and it's like a puzzle and basically you put your picture on the oh, upside down <laughs> you put your picture on it like that and then it exposes the okay. circles and then you get these like I don't wait for it's like I can't speak today like round um, color things so it's like a puzzle for colors um, and I will sit and do this with her she knows some of her colors and um, which doesn't know it that well yet so at the minute we're focusing more on her colors um, and I will ask her to um, you know pick up the green ones if we don't have this or um, put all the blue ones together and things like that or she's quite happy to sit and try and work out um, which color and match them up which she is quite happy to do sometimes I do need to help her um, 
because obviously it's a bit it's like all green and then but yellow circles around so she still needs a bit of help with that but she's getting better but this is just such a good little gadget it's um ever since we bought it she just went mental um and she does enjoy it she's quite happy to sit and do it for a few minutes um and like i said i need to do it with her and it just comes with tons like of different pictures um so it gets more difficult or it's simple um so that they don't get bored they don't get bored by doing the same one and that one is off amazon as well something else that we use to teach her what baby sorry <laughs> something else we use are these flashcards and I bought these when she was about 12 months uh, 12 months old and we've been doing these since then and we still do them now um, not as much as I like since being back at work but we do try and every day do some I'm so sorry guys Oh dear, did you lose Peppa? I'm just trying to put Peppa on my phone for her so that she's occupied for a minute. There we go, sweetheart. Um, so these flashcards, and they are just like colours and shapes. So it's, if I just take a few out, so it's like different kinds of shapes in different colours. Um, so we do that, I can't get them out now. <laughs> we do that with her. So it's just like, it will be like blue oval, orange circle. Um, and that is really, really good because there's so much in there that she doesn't get bored um, of it. So we've got the colours and shapes. We've got the alphabet one as well. So we do that one with it at the minute. And we've got the first word one which a lot of these she can say now but there's like a few on there that she can't say but this is just such a great thing because it's got pictures on it um and obviously children are very visual beings um so it's quite good so it's quite nice because we make it like a little quiz and um she likes it or i will say the wrong thing and she'll be like no mummy it's you know a sock or whatever it is so you can just about make anything fun um, I think I got those on Amazon as well, and they are, I think, really cheap. I think I paid something like £2 for them. It's really cheap. Something else that we do for colours, um, I bought these, like, fish. She's really into grouping things together now, so I will just, we'll sit at the table or whatever, and I will ask her to give me the blue ones or purple ones or I'll ask her to put them together um, or we will just get like little containers or cups um, or whatever and I will ask her to put like the orange one in a bowl and the red ones in a bowl so the I, th I think I got these off Amazon as well um, I'm not sure I'll have to look at them but yeah so that's really good for her as well to learn her colours because like I said she can um, at the minute she's 25 months and she can um say the whole or at least sing the whole alphabet she gets the gist of it um she recognizes some of them so um so we're focusing more on her colors at the minute because she's not that great at her colors yet she knows um she knows her colors but she sometimes still mixes them up or everything is pink some days <laughs> So does anyone else toddler do that? It's like everything is pink some days, even though she knows there's other colours out there. Um, so that one is a good one. Another thing that we that I got off Amazon to teach her shapes and colours um, and grouping. So it's like a puzzle and a colour and a shape thing. It's like, I don't know what you call this, but it's just like a little wooden stand thing with pegs in. And like one is shaped like a triangle. Then you just, the one is actually missing. I need to find it it's somewhere because it's come loose. Um, you've got one with two there, and then you've got your squares, and it comes with these shapes. Like, so for instance, like the circles are like you get a green circle, a yellow circle, a red circle. So while, while you're doing it with them, you can say, put the 
yellow circle on or put the red circle on and things like that um and she really enjoys that so it's like a puzzle and it teaches you colors and shapes at the same time and she really likes that as well um she's outgrown that a tiny bit now because we bought that like i don't know i think she was something like 15 or 16 months we've had that ages now another thing um for like motor skills that i got her is like it's just a piece of like string or um i can't speak today i think of <laughs> any words and basically it comes with all these like little bobbins i was like winding the bobbin <laughs> wind the bobbin up um so you get like different colors mine's got yellow blue green and red um and it's just to help um again with colors um can you see i'm focusing a lot on the colors and then it also teaches them motor skills because they need and amelia's only just now start like she's been able to get it through but then the pulling through she's been struggling for and she's only now getting to the point where she's like okay i can see it. i need to pull it through now but yeah so that really helps with their motor skills as well and you can ask them which colors you want them to put on so that's quite therapeutic for me myself but um so that again for colors teach you again and then one oh, i've got a couple other thing that we like is someone bought her this actually um it's like a shape sort short sort shape sorter bus um and again it's got lots of shapes it's got some there it's got some in the top um and she really likes this again it's like a puzzle so she really has to learn to match them all up um and again i will say the shapes to her she'll put that in some of them she needs help with because obviously she knows all the basic shapes that were still working um on some of the shapes and then I've got her this first learning easel for words as well. Now this is for three and up. So we do this with her and the nice thing about it is, is that it is wipe off. So this is something that we can use as she gets over as well. Um, and I think I got this off Amazon as well. So those are just a few of the things that we use to teach our daughter. Um, and it's quite nice because it's all interactive things. Um, and the whole family can get involved in teaching and these things have re I really do believe that each of these items have really helped um, Amelia You know learn as much as she has up till now you might notice that I didn't really put any like animal -y things in there that's because she's quite good with animals a friend from south africa bought her giant book with tons of animals so she's really good with animals um i try and focus on the things that um she's not that great at, at um different stages so obviously it, it's different and then like i said there's loads of other things that we use that i don't didn't put in this video um because otherwise we might be here all day if you would like a second part to this video i'm more than happy to do that so please comment down below and let me know if you enjoy these kind of videos if you're like me and sometimes get stuck on things to use um obviously you don't need to use all these kind of things to teach um your kids you know everywhere you can learn outside you can use anything in your house to teach your kids um but I just write these kind of things nice to do with her and sit down but you can use anything I mean we do a lot of painting and play doing things with her as well and even those things you can use to like teach them colors and you know things like that when you're outside we will play games um, with her like name the color of the cars and things like that so I'm by no means saying that you need these things to teach your children but if you are interested in these kind of videos then please comment and I'm more than happy to do more um, because I will have to do them in different parts because we do have quite a few things that we use with her. If you would like to know what kind of schedule I have for her learning as well, then please comment down below and I'm more than happy to do a video on that as well. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did like it, then please give it a thumbs up and please do subscribe. Don't forget to hit the big red button to subscribe. And yes, I know I just said that twice. <laughs> it's been a very long weekend um 
and I really really hope that you like my videos and that you would join my YouTube family and if there's any kind of videos that you guys would like me to make then please let me know and I will try and schedule them in at the minute I am only uploading once a week but I'm hoping that as time goes on that I will upload more so with that being said have a great week guys and I'll see you next week bye